the way we saw it again in Oaxaca City. This is actually our third time in this city. You can see the other episodes over there. And we, will, we are starting our day in a coffee place, which is a little restaurant. Uh, we were recommended this place because it's run by a Finnish girl and they say that you can have kova postis here. Unfortunately today they don't have kova posti. We will have to come back here. We've heard a lot of comments from you saying that when you visit Oaxaca City you have to go and visit the tree of Tule. Why haven't you been to see why haven't you been seeing the tree of Tule? And we have decided that today we are going to go and visit the tree of Tule. So this is the Tule tree in Tule or the tree from Tule and the tree is the biggest tree in the world. Of course the trees in North America are much higher but this tree is the thickest one. The diameter of the stem is 14 meters and the height is around uh, 42 meters and the tree has a cubic volume of 416 cubic meters so it's more than 2000 years old so it was be here already before Jesus was born and it's definitely one of the oldest trees in the world there's a little park where the tree is inside and you have to pay 10 pesos entrance fee which is around 50 cents if I'm not mistaken, yeah, 50 cents. And there's a little church next to it, and the tree is so big that the little church next to it just looks like a little uh, toy church. And the tree here in Tule is a Mexican uh, swamp cypress, Ahuehuete in Zapotec language. Part of the tree here in Tule, there's not much more to see other than the immaculately maintained gardens. And uh, there is an option if you want to get a guide, they have these children guides, which looks a little bit awkward about children labor, but they seem to be enjoying doing their guidance here in the park of the tree of the Tule. And as there's not much, not much more to see here, we will take you to another place, which is of interest in this area. So we drove about 40 minutes east from uh, Tule and we arrived to the second most visited archaeological site of the state of Oaxaca after Monte Alban. You can see the Monte Alban video here. This place is called Mitla and Mitla is also a Zapotec uh, place, ruins of Zapotec uh, buildings. This place was established around thousand of our time and they've already built a new church here, not a new church, but the uh, Conquistadores, they built the San Pablo uh, church here, which is also apparently worth visiting. So Mitla was uh, actually for, for the Zapotecs a place for the priests and the ruling class. Uh, uh, this is a very famous place for the mosaics that you can see around. And of course, when the Conquistadores came, they built this uh, San Pablo's parish on the middle on top of the most holy place of the Zapotecs using the stones that they uh, found by destroying the Zapotec monuments. But quite a lot of this is uh, remained here in these different courtyards. And these agave plants here are just one kind out of many different varieties or species and this is this one especially is a maguey and this is used uh, for mezcal which is uh, typical from this area here and they cut all the leaves away and just use the heart of the plant for the distilling process and Mitla actually came into importance only after Monte Alban 
went into ruins, so this is much younger than Monte Alba. And as you can see behind me, it's all characterized by these amazing mosaics. Wondering if there were some precious stones on these mosaics in the past. And this is another square here in Mitla, also with beautiful ornaments surrounding it. And in the middle, or within the square, there are two tombs. You can see it behind me, the people are going in. And we had to wait a little bit because there were a lot of people visiting, but now the space is almost empty. So let's have a look into the tombs. earthquake right now because then I'm going to be buried alive. This was our day in La Tule or El Tule sorry it's the famous tree and Mitla near Oaxaca so we picked two new uh, things to do in Oaxaca in a box Thank you for watching the way we saw it. Safe travels always. Bye.